Hi, I'm Larry Herb, Xbox Live's Major Nelson. One of the most exciting parts of my job is seeing the technology around Xbox One come to life day by day and even hour by hour. Today, I thought it would be fun to look at the Friends app on Xbox One. Now, what you see here is the default Friends view. You'll see your feed in the middle, which highlights what your friends are doing as they do it, updating in real time. Off to your right, you'll see your favorites, which we'll get to momentarily. Then there's your party, if you have one active. Now, if we enter my profile, you'll get a snapshot of your profile in all its glory, including your reputation score there at the bottom. You'll also be able to check your recent activity, achievements, and uploaded videos. If I head back and choose friends, I'll get the full list, which I can sort in a variety of ways, as you can see. Now, if I choose a friend, I'll see their profile, including account of their friends, their actual friends list, and how many followers they have. I can also see their recent activity, achievements, and videos. We'll go back to followers in a moment, but first I want to talk a bit about favorites. Basically, if I add someone to my favorites list, I can quickly access that list. Now this is particularly great if you have a core group of friends that you play with all the time. Add them to your favorites and you won't have to sort through your entire list to track them down and send invites. Think of it as a snapshot of who you care about the most on Xbox Live. Now this becomes even more useful when you're following hundreds of people. On Xbox One, you can follow people without being on their friends list. For example, if I'm a huge fan of certain pro gamers or celebrities, or I just heard about some guy that makes incredible fours of five clips on upload, I could potentially follow them by adding them to my feed and friends list. Once I follow them, they'll receive a notification. If they choose, they can follow me back and we'll both appear on each other's friends list. Of course, if that person didn't want to be followed, they could set their privacy settings to block their profile. Chances are you'll start seeing people not on your friends list start following you as well. And you can always check out that growing list by selecting followers. I think this is going to be one of the best ways to meet new people on Xbox Live. Before we go though, there's one more thing I want to show you. Xbox Snap Activity. Now I love this feature. This is my activity feed, updating what my friends are doing in real time as they do it. This way, I can see when people are starting up a game that I might want to join in on. Essentially, this is the feed portion of the Friends app customized to work perfectly in Snap mode. I hope you enjoyed this informal little walkthrough of the Friends app. Getting to share these features as we get closer to launch is so much fun for me and everyone here at Xbox. Thanks for watching.